Hey everybody, it's Keith K with another Stranded Deep mini tutorial. This time we're going to take a look at the tanning rack, uh, which is one of the new structures that came out um, in the past couple of releases along with the loom, which you see there. Um, and I have a separate tutorial on that. But if you go ahead and open the crafting menu, and uh, you can see there's furniture structures and tools. Of course, you can navigate, flip through these, but we want to be on the crafting, crafting menu. And choose the structure, scroll down, tanning rack and you can see that you need four lashings which I have and four sticks which I've got plenty of. Like anything else in the crafting menu you select it and then you're just gonna place it. So I'm gonna just keep these kinda together. Now in order to use the tanning hide we've got to collect some raw hide from a dead boar uh, which I've just killed uh, off, off screen here and now we're going to um, have to skin him. And you can see that we're gathering skin oh, first disgusting. and then the meat. Used to be that you would just get meat, um, but now we will get, as you can see, rawhide first, uh, and then we'll actually get the meat. So uh, I've also got a seagull here. Let's just go ahead and skin him as well and see how that works. Oh, it's disgusting. And you can see that goes straight to meat. So really the wild boar is the only way we're going to get some rawhide so that we can um, create some, craft some leather. Uh, which is required now for the spear gun, uh, for the refined spear. You can now no longer make this with lashing. You need some leather. And the refined axe. You also need leather here instead of lashings. Um, and we will show you how to do that in just a second. All right, and much like the loom, you can't actually interact with the tanning rack. What you do is you go back to the crafting menu, and in this case, we're gonna to go to tools, and we're gonna to wanna to craft leather. You can see here, you need a tanning rack and rawhide, which I've got two of. And the trick is you have to be somewhat close to the tanning rack. So just to show you that, I'll go over here. And you can see that it says zero of one tanning racks, even though I do have it built. All right, so we'll go back up here, and we will take the rawhide, if you remember, I've got rawhide here from that boar that we killed just a minute ago. Go to the crafting menu. You don't actually have to select it, um, as I just did, and you'll choose leather, like anything else. In crafting, you're just gonna, you're gonna see the outline, and you're gonna drop it. Click on the left mouse button, to create it and again we'll have to go to the crafting menu choose leather and one of the neat things is as you start to use craft something over and over again it seems to float to the top here and we'll do that so now we've got two leather and we can actually go ahead uh, and craft a refined spear which I think is much better than a regular spear so we have to have a crude spear which, which I have a stone tool and now that we've got leather, we can go ahead and create that refined spear. The other thing that we can craft with a leather is a refined axe. So I need a crude axe and a stone tool. Let's just go grab those. I've got a crude axe around here somewhere. There he is. Grab him. I definitely need to clean up around here, but... Uh, Right now, everything is just a mess. Until I can figure out what I'm gonna do with my storage system here. So, go ahead and drop this guy, um, just so you can see what we're doing. So we've got our leather, we've got our crude spear, sorry, ax, and then I've got my stone tool here. All right, we don't need to select it. we we'll just go to the crafting menu scroll down to our refined axe. You can see now we've got our crude axe, our stone tool, and our leather. We can go ahead and create a refined axe. 
You can see it's wrapped in leather there. All right, so that's the mini tutorial for the tanning rack. rack. Hope you liked it. Uh, if you did and you'd like to see more tutorials and videos, please like and subscribe and leave me a comment down below. I do read them all. And thank you, and I'll see you again soon.